serikali tafadhili ajira ya walimu wa muda ili kudhibiti idadi kubwa ya wanafunzi kufuatia mpango wa asilimia moja wa usajili wa wanafunzi kutoka shule ya msingi hadi shule ya upili haya ni kwa mujibu wa waziri wa elimu Professor George Magoha uh, Professor George Magoha alikuwa akizungumza kwenye kongamano la walimu wakuu mjini Mombasa Walimu wakuu wa shule za upili humu nchini walikutana kwenye kongamano la 44 ambapo waziri wa elimu Profesa George Magoha alikuwa mninaji mkuu kwenye ufunguzi huo. Magoha alisema kuwa fedha za kuajiri walimu kwa muda sasa zimetengwa kwenye bajeti ya mwaka huu wa kifedha na zitatolewa kwa shule zote za umma. I was first of all shocked that the ministry of education is the most difficult everywhere in the world <laughs> so it, it has kind of energized me and my dear brothers and sisters in this room you are there for my employers because i am not proud i'm just saying that if i can't deliver then i don't need to be here and i need you you don't need me i need you as a team in order for me to deliver Magoha alisema kuwa wizara yake itashirikiana kwa karibu na tume ya kuajiri walimu nchini TSE ili kuchunguza utumizi wa fedha hizo As you criticize us give us concrete solutions to move forward Why do I say so I am a professor and people say I am proud Yes if I'm not proud of myself who is going to be proud for me So you should also be proud of yourselves as teachers. Do you get the point? Kusiana na mtaalamu pia waziri Magoha alidokeza kuwa wizara ya elimu haitalegeza msimamo wake kuhusu swala hilo akiwataka wanaopinga kubadilisha nia yao. And one of the orders was that I pro, we make sure there is money for teacher interns. And that that money is going to be available. She's diplomatic. I'm not in that section. <laughs> that money is going to be available. It will be available to all schools to empower them to employ interns. Magoha alitambua na kupongeza mashirika na vyama ambavyo yamekuwa yakiunga mkono mchakato wa kufanikisha mtala huo. Nikiripoti ya Jamvi la MCI. Mie Iru Chege.